Hey guys, it's Juliana. Uh, today we are playing Little Briar Rose. Uh, it's this game that I saw in Game Jolt and I thought it looked um, awesome. Like I just love like the whole stained glass aesthetic they've got going on. Um, it's like basically the same story as Sleeping Beauty. Um, there was like a little cutscene thing. Oh, oh, here it goes. Perfect. Here, I'll let you guys watch this cutscene. That's definitely not uh, the same thing as Sleeping Beauty. How a queen the wrong one scorned on her daughter the price fell. A beautiful girl, a princess most fair, and a kingdom lost for many a year. Guests for her baptism were picked with care lest the wicked fairy appear. But she wanted revenge for such an abuse. Uninvited came she with an ominous gift. She shot live long, the hag cursed and broke loose. A spindle will prick her, in death she shall drift. was averted, but as fate played out, the girl fell asleep, and the kingdom did too. A kiss will save her, one of true love, but many have tried and met their demise. Of that prince, though, pure like a dove, some say he'll go far to prove otherwise. This game is so freaking cute. It's so cute. Just awesome. Alright, now we'll play. <laughs> um, oh geez. Uh, um, we're just gonna, we're just gonna cancel that. Okay. Select your previous selected file to continue the game. Yeah, I understand how saving works. A little quicker, so new. Hey, dude! Finally, I have arrived to the outskirts of the Enchanted Forest. It has been a long journey, but this is the last obstacle I shall challenge. It is I, or it is me, Prince Stefan, I, who will save Princess Aurora, who, according to the legend, lies sleeping beyond this Enchanted Forest. I am normal. And yet, the thorny briars are way denser than I expected. <laughs> I like how they're like... <laughs> and yet... I was like, way denser than I expected. Will my sword be enough to carve a passage through these brambles? I like that way better. <laughs> this is adorable. Oh god, it's so cute! Oh, but what happens? It seems, it almost seems like an invitation to enter deep into these thorns. <laughs> oh my god. What? A fairy? <laughs> Welcome, Ogre. I am the fairy who wants to undertake such tasks and such things. Uh, I am here to res rescue Princess Aurora and unchain her from her doom. Oh, I see this one. There is still a good thing to be the fairy in this world. I wish you the best of luck, but you are not amazing. You shall prepare yourself to face this adventure. The forest is enchanted and many will pass their way there in time past. I thank you for your advice. I shall be careful. Use the mouse to move around and interact with the environment. I got it! Got it! Got it! <laughs> okay, cool. That was just like... Okay. Nothing's in my inventory. Okay. So... Quick as rock. Uh, I click this very... My prince prepares up to face the enemy for such a moment and may pass away the Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I'm adorable. I'm so happy to play this game. The bird. Whoa! There! The castle! I was like, that's a mushroom! 
Proceeding seems impossible with all these rambles. It will not be an easy feat. Okay. It is just a bird roosting in its nest. It looks like someone has built a mailbox for it. I wonder why. Ka ka. Okay. Can I click this mailbox? Oh, there we go. Say the same thing. Okay, got it. I'm gonna look at this rock. Ooh, a briar rose is thriving amongst these brambles. A huge, mu oh, right. <laughs> a huge mushroom to which some chandeliers and weird items have been attached. Uh, okay. Alright, well, um, is there anything else that I can look at around here? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Here we go. Dude! Now look here, a village of enchanted creatures. They look like gnomes. I only heard about them in legends. I shall try and interact with them. Okay. Maybe I won't. Maybe I don't want to do that. Can I go in the house? No. Dude, I like this artsy fartsy gnome. Everyone, everyone here keeps whining and there's not even one gnome who understands my art. The browns are shamed to- Oh wait, <laughs> sorry. Everyone here keeps- Everyone keeps whining. Yokels. I do not think he is talking about me. It rather looks like he is mumbling something to himself. Working in this village is impossible. They fill you with daft requests and just choke completely your genius. But I'm done. From now on, they want something they can well do it themselves. I'm taking up botanics. Hmm. It looks like there's a no one strike here. Really? Oh, adventurer, welcome to the Gnome Village, home to great builders and artisans. Or so it should be. My subjects have recently had a quarrel. Now they can't, accom they can't accomplish anything no more. They have been working on the new library for days, but now the works are in a deadlock. As long as they fight, this situation won't change, I fear. Mushroom. Ah, under this tree, some wild mushrooms have grown. Judging from their nimble conditions, they are edible. Exception made for the red one. That one is alive and well. So can I like grab it? Can I, can I have it? No, oh, I'm not allowed to have it. Okay. Can I go up here? No. Oh, okay. All right. Oh, geez. All right. Well, I guess we'll go down here. Okay. Here. This one with the heart. That other one. <laughs> Sorry. <coughs> This one with the art, that other with the style. No one thinking about doing stuff as it should be. I won't lose time on trinkets with a structure as strong paper. It wouldn't withstand a cricket sneeze. This gnome does not look in the right mood for talking right now. He looks quite nervous. Okay. Nice. Okay, go ahead. I don't know what to do with you gnomes. What do you, what do you want, gnomes? You have something else to say? I don't I don't know what to do with you. I'm gonna go this way. Can I go over here? No. No. Looks like my only option is that way or that way. So I'm not entirely sure what to do right now. And Juliana's lost. Wait, can I climb this ladder? What the heck is going on? How do I how do I progress in this game? Can I go down here? I'll click off to this way. I do not know what to do here. Uh, help! Solve this puzzle. Okay. Wait. Wait, wait. Wait, is this one? This one? This one? This way. Actually, this way, this way. This way. This way, this way. Oh, they can just flip flop. I thought that you had to rotate them. Okay, I solved it. Give me a hint. 
Maybe you should check better here. Okay. Sounds good. We'll do. Could go to the, could go to the spring and pile some rocks, put a door, maybe that would be much easier than wood. Oh sure. You'll <laughs> sorry. <laughs> oh sure. You'll fit just fine on travel rights. Got some monsters. None at all. <laughs> Sir, do not lose time. Come, please. I need to talk with you. What the fuck? Me and the carpenter think that you could help us. You should get the architect to understand how much you'd like to see on the library. Me? How could I change his mind? He's a big hard head. Uh, a braggart and a fake though. He'd surely be flattered by the interest of a foreign prince in his work. That will get him back to work, I'm sure. You have to help us. So will you help us? Fine by me. By now, I am curious to see this library. Oh, sorry. Fine by me. By now, I am curious to see this library completed. Perfect. Thank you so much. We're counting on you. Er, uh, I heard you're the architect of this pretty village. Oh, yes, yes. I, of course. I come from afar, looking forward to admiring the renowned architecture of the Gnomish Belt. You come for nothing, then. The Gnomish people, the Gnomish, the Gnomish people just lost its greatest expert in the field. Is it truly impossible to see the works of a master architect of your most excellent skill? I know there's a library in the works. The painter, the painter is the greatest expert in ignorance. His request and the other gnomes' demands make it impossible for me to work. <laughs> How can anyone expect me to do anything up to my skill when I have to cater to the winds of the whole village? Well, to be honest, I would not know. That's it! <laughs> what the fuck? That's it! No one knows because no one dares to imagine how it is to be in my shoes. Hmm, I see. But you know, maybe you could find an agreement. Seeing you working would mean so much to me. And you want to see a sublime work? Want to witness the creation of this damn library? Well, do it yourself! Now you're the architect to this village. So even abroad, they'll get the bump. Get what the whoa, whoa. <laughs> so even abroad, they'll get what bumpkins of the gnomes of the forest are. Huh? What? What? What a wonderful idea! A foreigner bringing his architect architectonic style to our village, buried by eternal by the eternal thorns. You've got my full endorsement, young prince. We'll be honored to host your flair. But I'm a prince. I do not know how to construct a building. Our architect, <laughs> sorry, our architect just now came through you all his studies. You can use them as you like and discard the less useful to your plans. If this can help ease your quarrels, I shall try. If the architect agrees, it does. Now you'll see what I was talking about. Okay, these are, these are mine now, I guess. Okay, I have to find out what the gnomes need for the building. Would you like to read the tutorial? No. <laughs> uh. Okay. For the library, I like I like this one, and I like um I like that hat, and I like I like that one, and I like that one, and I like. Good. Build it. From your face, I'd say the project is ready. Should I tell the other nerves, the other nerves to start working? No. Not yet. I would like to revise some details. So wait, what do you want? It doesn't. It didn't go exactly as planned, but you look way more trustworthy and clever than that garage architect. We do a great job. Finally, the building will have a likable shape. Will be cozy. Will be full of frippery, block and my free ride and imagination. Yes. Be careful. Give the wall the right. I can give the rain points to myself and my paintings. What do you want? You're the one directing the works? What are you thinking? What is your role in this endeavor? I'm the one who will have to keep the project standing. I cut boards, craft pillars, and work on the wall suit. I'm a village carpenter. If you want to know what I think, whatever you fancy, the building should be in on the foundations raised from the ground. The village doesn't bear rain that well, and the books will get moldy very quickly. At foundations, they get nourishment from water. We'll keep the building steady and dry. Okay. And what do you want? The 
sketches I drew while trying to create. Please, everyone else around that table, do whatever you want with them. As an expert in your trade, would you have some hints to give me? I try to understand what you're talking about. Some can't even explain themselves clearly. If I were you, I would throw them mercilessly. I shall keep it in mind. Thank you. Make sure you choose a roof fit the style of the village. What is the style of the village? Like these rounded roofs. Well, what do you want? Have you started working already? Good, good. I have just one request for the library. I should have a bird bird nest proof chimney. There's a damned postman bird haunting my nightmares. Every time his girlfriend comes to visit, he makes their nest on my chimney and I get smoked. I would like the new building to be spared from his fate. Okay. Um do you wait, do you have anything else you want to say to me? The building will be likable but not flashy and the walls will be there waiting for the new person with my I can hardly wait. Do you have anything else to say? I didn't really Foundations are the key to a solid building. Raised in yours. That's essential. Okay. Let me take a look here. So. Raised and nourished. So. That would be like. This one? Oh yeah, because those are carrots. Yee. And the building. He said walls. Just like plain and simple walls. Maybe the red one? And then the roof needs to match the rest of the village. Like this? I don't really like that one. But maybe it's this one? I don't know. A bird proof chimney. Is that a bird proof chimney? This is not flashy. But I like the flower. I think that's good. Wait, it was right there. I just noticed that it was on. Stop, I don't, I didn't want, I didn't want to do that. Um, raised and nourishing foundations, yep. Crow nest proof chimney, simple but pretty walls. I like, no, I like the blue one better. And I said the roof needs to match the rest. I, I like that one. <laughs> okay, I'll go with that, see what they think. Yeah, let's do it. Let's build it. Let's go. Woo! My beautiful house. All done. Let it let it not be said that gnomes are slackers when working. Fast and precise, as always. Good job. But how can I paint on these walls? I like the design, I say. My plans already contain perfection in them myself. Looks like a good job. The chimney looks too simple. It wouldn't scare a rabbit. Well, before judging, let's see. Oh, okay, so I gotta change this and the parts. Oh, he broke it. <laughs> um, th this is a deadly trap! You okay, boss? Serves you right. How can you pronounce the festival because of stupid quarrels? You crooks? Prince, architect, were you trying to kill me? This is high treason. No, 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 my projects are perfect. This, poss this could possibly happen. I assure you, it was an accident. I did not believe... Of the enchanted forest, the piece you broke. Now give up your mantle and wear your new yoke. What? I'm a gnome now? What is going on? <laughs> what? <laughs> um, okay. So, <laughs> is that like a prince meeting? Uh, all right, so he didn't like the walls. So maybe these walls, and he didn't like the, the chimney. So maybe this chimney? We'll try that. Maybe prince gets murdered again. Yeah, let's do it. Yes, we can begin. <laughs> I can't believe that. This is one. Oh, then, let it not be said that I'm so slack as when I'm working. Fast and precise, as always. Good job. But how can I paint the these walls? I like the design. Looks like a good job. Oh, God. Okay. 
Okay, so this guy's not happy, so it's gonna collapse. Oh no, no, we can't be prince. Oh my god, going through like two princes per episode. Oh poop. Uh, uh poop. Uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, poop. Uh, oh, this one's cute. I don't want to kill him. <laughs> Ah, oh, man. Alright, um, I guess we'll try again on this house next time on Power Up Princesses. Uh, I will see you guys then. <laughs> Bye!